Hi, welcome back to Sci-Fi Fans. If this is your first time here, thank you very much for stopping by. And if you're a returning viewer, thank you very much for your continued support. I really do appreciate it. Today, I'd like to talk to you about the 1960s film, Mary Poppins. Now, there's an interesting backstory to Mary Poppins. And if you want to go into more detail about that, Disney did actually make it into a film called Saving Mr. Banks, which I believe it stars Tom Cruise, not Tom Cruise, Tom Hanks. <laughs> it, well, Tom, Tom, Tom's Tom. Uh, so, yeah, that's it stars Tom Hanks and it gives you the backstory behind the problems that Disney had with acquiring the rights for Mary Poppins. Um, so that put to one side, I'll probably make that into a video myself here at some point as well. So anyway, today's video is all about Mary Poppins and if you enjoy the content that I put up here on YouTube, please do consider subscribing if you haven't done so already and um, hit that notification bell so you're notified of when I produce new content. And that said, thank you very much for your time and on with the show. At the start of Mary Poppins, there is a scene where a lot of nannies are all in a queue and they're potential applicants for the post of the nanny in Mary Poppins. But did you know that the uh, nannies that were all stood in the queue were mostly men in drag? There aren't many actresses that have been nominated for an Oscar and won it. Just ask Mel Streep and Sigourney Weaver, who have multiple nominations and are still yet to pick up that Oscar, that Golden Award and crowning achievement in their career. But did you know that Mary Poppins was Julie Andrews' first big screen appearance and she was also nominated for Best Actress and she won that Oscar on the first attempt. In this day and age of technology, if you wanted to create a scene or change the local environment, you'd simply put it through a computer program and come back with something realistic enough to use in film and games. But in uh, the 1960s, computer technology wasn't really uh, as it is today, shall we say. So in order to create the backdrop and a lot of the scenes of London from 1910, they used over 100 glass and matte paintings. And while we're talking about technology, with streaming services taking over from DVDs and videos, it's interesting to note that Mary Poppins was the very first film made by Walt Disney that was released on DVD. All right, Governor, I think that's where we'll bring this video to its conclusion, if you don't mind me saying so, in a very poor Dick Van Dyke impression, doing a poor impression of a Cockney. Um, thanks again for watching this video. If you've enjoyed yourself here, please do hit the subscribe button and don't forget to request notifications. Videos go out three times a week, Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, and uh, I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye.